Hi, Otter. Um, my name is Veronica Conley. I am a mental health tech at Wentworth Douglas Hospital in the emergency department. I am in nursing school um, and COVID has made us remote and it is incredibly hard for me specifically because I have ADHD and it makes it, um, I'm not an auditory learner whatsoever, which a lot of our, our lectures now are uh, recorded. So what I do and how I started using Otter was I started uploading the um, the MP3s of our lectures, and I made a transcript of each lecture. So then I was able to play the lecture as I read it, and it just helped facilitate the learning process. It was it was it saved my life last semester, and it is currently saving my life now. So I'm hugely appreciated appreciative for that fun thing too, being a student that, you know, teachers say things like, oh, remember this for the exam, keyword exam. And what I love about Otter is that you can search exam, like the keywords, and then it'll bring up all the situations in which the teacher has told me to remember something on the exam. <laughs> so that's been like amazing. And I've been helping my friends too, like, oh, oh guys, like, like here at uh, 17 and 23 seconds, she says, this thing will be on the exam. So it's been like a giant lifesaver and really cool. So I've recommended it to all of my friends um, in nursing school as well. Um, another uh, more unconventional way that this has been helping me is um, recently my mother-in-law passed away. Um, she had terminal cancer. And um, before she died, we I did a project with her um, using my voice recorder. I recorded her giving advice about parenting knowing that, you know, all of her five children would never be able to ask her when, you know, we all had children, like, you know, what, what do you do? Like, you know, like calling your mom, be like, oh man, like, what do I tell, what do I tell my child? She just got her period. And the thing about my mother-in-law, she was a wonderful mother. She was amazing. And, um, I wanted to like capture, you know, like a, a parenting chronicles, like a series of advice um, given to us by our dear mother-in-law. Um, and she, uh, so she recently passed away and now I'm going through all these old voice recordings and it's hours and hours and hours. Um, and I'm making transcripts. Um, that is my project right now. I'm making transcripts of her, um, of these parenting chronicles that we did uh, last year. So that's been really amazing um, to be able to make these transcripts because, you know, voice recordings, SD cards, flash drives, these can get corrupted over time. But having the transcripts of these things, it makes it possible to pass down through generations so that they can know who their ancestor was. Um, and yeah, it's it's just it's amazing. Otter has helped me so much. Um, and in ways I wouldn't expect either, you know, again, having ADHD, um, I'm not an auditory learner whatsoever. So, um, one other way that I used it was, um, when my mother-in-law was passing away, we were talking to the doctor on the phone and, you know, he was telling us what was going on, um, using all of this medical jargon, like way above all our heads and, you know, and he's hard, he's hard to get a hold of. And so what I did was I, voice recorded it on speakerphone and I uploaded it to Otter and um, I was able to like go and like go through what he said, look up, take time, look up what he, you know, like what these tests meant and, and what the words like he was saying, like what they meant. Um, and it allowed us to come to a better understanding of what he's saying um, and, and really like capture and tell other family members like what was going on exactly um and it allowed us to make better um end of life decisions for my mother-in-law who was passing away so i am hugely appreciative of otter um it's been life-changing truly so thank you so much for existing